Hey Internet, for this video I'm going to solve a probability statistics problem. A research on new drivers shows that within the first year of obtaining a license, the probability of being involved in a car accident in the first year is 55% for males and 30% for females. Suppose four people are randomly selected, two male and two female. Assuming their driving history is independent, find the probability at most three will be involved in an accident within the first year of receiving their license. So we have 55% male and there's two of them. 30% female and there's two of them as well. There's four people total. So we want the probability at most three of the four people will be in an accident during the year. Let A equals accidents. Since we want at most three will be in an accident, let's take a look at the probabilities individually. Probability A equals zero, which is zero accidents. Probability A equals one, which is one of them has an accident. Plus probability A equals two, two accidents. Probability A equals three, three people gone to an accident. And probability a equals 4, which is all 4 gone to an accident. If we add each of these, we get the probability 1. Since we're adding the probabilities of every possible event, the event we are interested in is at most 3 accidents. Each of these events are mutually exclusive from each other, i.e. the outcome at the end of the year can either be 0, 1, 2, or 3 accidents. Since the probability we want is at most 3 accidents, the probability we are looking for is either 0, 1, 2, or 3 accidents. And as I mentioned, since they're mutually exclusive probabilities, we add. So the probability 1 accident happens, plus the probability 2 accident happens, plus the probability 3 accidents happen. These are going to be a lot of probabilities to add, so instead, we'll pull a little trick to make the calculations easier. If the entire possible outcomes 0, 1, two, three, or four accidents make up the probability one. When added together, we can just subtract the probability we are not interested in from one, in this case, four, to get the same probability for at most three events, which is the addition of probabilities zero, one, two, or three accidents occurring. So probability at most three accidents occurring is probability A accidents is less than or equal to three is equal to 1 minus probability A accidents is greater than 3 is equal to 1 minus probability A equals 4 accidents. This equals to 1 minus the probability all four people get into an accident. So the first male gets into an accident and we know it happens 55% of the time. So 0 0.55 times the second male also gets into an accident, 0 0.55 times first female gets into an accident, which happens 30% of the time, so 0 0.30 times second female gets into an accident, 0 0.30 as well. Put this all in the calculator and get 0 0.9725 or 97%. Just so you can see it better, if this represents the entire set of probabilities 0, 1, 2, 3, or 4 accidents happening, we are removing this little portion of all 4 happening and are left with the stuff here which is 0 to 3 accidents happening. The probability at most 3 will be in an accident, which is what we want. And that's it. Hope this video helps. Thanks for watching.